was gonna say I got a bunch in here. Not, not a bunch, a bunch, but. Yeah. We found the gun shrimp tonight. Did you get? You got I some here? Mm. It, it was about to go. Guys, you want to come and look? Guys, come and look. Wow, look at all those. Whoa. Gabriel, come look at these. What? Come look, come look. Did you see a worm fall out? Yeah. I had a couple of uh, worm. uh, worms in there as well. Sometimes you pump out worms. Yeah. Some, you know, you never know what you're gonna pump out. There's kind of an art to it, right? You follow the trails and it's the holes. It's the holes. Yes, yeah, so like kind of, like usually you want a hole kind of like this here. It looks like it's kind of freshly got something kind of yeah. yeah. pushing it out. Here's a so, worm. These are really good for uh, surf perch in uh, in the surf right over on the other side. Oh no, kidding! Mm -hmm. Wow. Well, this guy, he just pulled one of the ghost shrimp out of the water, like... When I go around pumping, sometimes you don't get them out of the hole, so if you disturb their hole and make a ruckus so a little while later, thinking. they'll climb out and be like, what is going on? Yeah, what's happening? And then, it, and then Lucas grabbed one. Yeah, no, I was cracking up. I heard him. He's like, I got a ghost shrimp. I'm like, oh, they must have found one of those guys that crawled out. Yeah. This is fun doing this. So I wanted to get one of these for the kiddies. You know, oh, like, dude, this is great. And okay. tomorrow, um, we're leaving from Shelter Island, and there's... I think eight of us. Yeah. And so I come out the day before and get grow shrimp, and then we just go out to the kelp, and we, we're in like Hobie kayaks, so it's like sit on top and pedal, you know what yeah, I mean? You're yeah. not like yeah. down low or whatever. And we'll go in there and we just hang them over. Last last uh, trip a couple weeks ago, got limits. 10 guys, limits for sheephead for 10 people. Oh yeah. I love stuff. Oh yeah, that's awesome. By the way, I have a YouTube channel. I'm recording right now. Is it okay to put these guys on, or do you want me to keep them off? No, no, no. It's fine. As long as they're okay with Grandma. Yeah, no, totally fine. Yeah. Okay. You it's no, totally fine. Okay. You okay. It's yeah. it's Sand Dog Kayak Adventure. See my hat? Okay. S A N D O G. Well, we'll we'll, we'll check it out. Right? Yep. You'll yeah. be on the next one. Hello, YouTube world. <laughs> <laughs> That's so much fun. No, this is. This is what probably is like to get the kids out in the Oh yeah. Doing this as opposed to I was just talking to my brother last night. He's I've got two nieces, his two daughters, and um I was like, Jeff, we gotta come down to Mission Point Park and just, you know, I'll bring a couple of kayaks, bring the snorkel in, a mask and this and that. I'm like, we'll see octopus, we'll catch fish, we'll yeah. pump shrimp, like it's an amazing day. Yeah, we too. Absolutely. <laughs> nice. Oh, it's nice to meet you. Good to meet you as well. I'm Glenn, by the way. Pleasure. I'm Paul. Paul? Yeah. Good to meet you. Nice one. And I'm over here. If I'm getting stuff in this now, they can come over and screw around and look or whatever. It's fine by me. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Sand Dog Kayak Adventure. I'm in Mission Point Park right now. I am just about done getting ghost shrimp for the sheephead trip tomorrow. Sheephead trip tomorrow, April 1st. It's the rockfish opener slash sheephead trip. It's sold out. There's no more room. Uh, it actually sold out pretty quick. So if you want to be on the next one, I'll put the dates up now and first come first serve. I think it took about five days to fill up last time. So I'm imagining it'll probably be about the same this time. So look for that video coming soon. Uh, there'll be a sheephead video coming out. Uh, we're going fishing for them tomorrow. But I want to let you know what you're about to watch. Uh, every now and then we get some people that come into town and they're only here for a little while, a couple of days. They can only fish whatever day they're here. So. We had a couple guys yesterday. His bro was visiting. They haven't seen each other in 20 years. They wanted to fish together. The weather was supposed to be horrible. They said, well, we're gonna rent a 19 foot uh, boat from Dana. Will you jump on board and show us what's up in Mission Bay? I said, the weather's gonna be hell, but let's go. So we went out yesterday. You'll see what happened. I've never fished in uh, any sort of conditions like this ever before. It's definitely a first for me. Let me know in the comments if, if you've ever fished in these conditions before but we went out it was rough we had a great time they got a little food a couple of drinks at the barefoot bar got a spotty so check it out wish us luck for tomorrow at the sheephead talk to you later you. so we're fishing in the hail ow dude that just plucked me in the face <laughs> holy <laughs> gotta admit never done this Come out to San Diego, have some fun, and do some fishing. Yes, this is uh, dude, this is nuts. Yeah, we're this is us. This is what we're doing. This was Joe's idea. He's like, ah, I don't give a shit. We'll go. He'll never do anything with you. Something weird. I'll fucking have it. <laughs> I cannot believe this is happening. Well, when I call you to set up. 
Rick, you'll know who I am. Uh, yeah, Rick. You just call me uh, Hailstorm Joe. <laughs> Legit hail. <laughs> Bro, this isn't stopping. This is, it's like hailing for minutes. It's all, I like, guess the deck is slippery as now. Yeah, oh yeah. Joe, this is a, this ain't quite Texas hail, but it's definitely Virginia hail. Ow, I just <laughs> took another one to the face. What'd you do? <laughs> this is nuts. I thought he was talking about my ex-wife. <laughs> Dude. I don't even know what to do. We're just going to sit here and be screwed. <laughs> if we had people around us, it would get weird with those people too. Just weird shit happens to us, man. It's cool. <laughs> so maybe we're not going to be taking that trip, Joe. <laughs> if this is how your shit normally goes, <laughs> you'll always have a story. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. First fish of the rainy day. What do we got? We got a spotted bay bass. Bada bing, bada boom. Bloop. Bang! On the on the stinger hook. Let's see, am I steering the right? Okay. I stop, I forget I'm steering, I'll start doing stuff. I'm like, oh I'm going to the dock. Heading into the dock. Right on. Oh, and I got a pair of pliers, uh. Oh, you got it? Okay. Bada bing. There, there are fish in here, see? No, we don't ever keep the spotties, they taste like They're the funnest bass to catch, the worst to eat. Really? Yeah. If we get a sand bass or a sculpin or a calico, definitely keep that 14 inches.